Hello everyone, I'm Father Brian Gross. I'm the pastor of Epiphany Catholic Church in Watford City and Our Lady of Consolation in Alexander. Uh, Father Maus, your pastor, has asked me to come uh, to Our Lady of Grace and offer a healing service next Sunday night. Um, I believe it's 7 p.m., but obviously you double check on that um, at your parish there. So um, I'm really grateful uh, for the invitation. Uh, thank you to Father Maus for extending um, his generosity in, in asking me to come. Uh, and so just to answer a couple questions uh, about what is a healing service, uh, why do we do this? Um, so the first thing is, uh, five years ago, if you'd have told me I would have been leading healing services in the diocese and throughout different parts of uh, the country, I would have told you you're crazy. Um, Jesus just began uh, years ago sort of inviting me uh, to start sort of taking some risks this way, um, while having an opportunity to spend some time with a ministry called Encounter Ministries. Uh, they're out of the... Uh, sort of Detroit, Ann Arbor area uh, of Michigan, um, spend some time with them, uh, praying with them, praying with other people for healing and, and other, other kinds of prayers, not just healing. But um, anyway, so uh, the Lord then really invited me to start doing some of this in, in the Diocese of Bismarck um, and his generosity in, in healing people and being good uh, to all of you um, through your openness and faith to receive him has really been extraordinary. Uh, I used to think that when I prayed with someone, it used to be a thought of, you know, I wonder if God's going to do something. Um, and now my attitude, very frankly, is just, I'm just excited to see what God's going to do. Um, when a person is prayed with, uh, when a person is vulnerable before God, uh, the person is always going to experience some form of his peace, his love, and his comfort, and way more than I ever would have thought, um, his healing, his physical, uh, his presence for the purpose of physical healing. So last week, uh, or a couple weeks ago, I led a healing service in Bismarck at the cathedral. Uh, there were over 400 people there. It was absolutely extraordinary. So uh, when we do come to a healing service, uh, just a couple of things also to note. There's going to be first uh, a sermon that I'll give, a homily of about, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes or so. Some instruction as to why we're able to do this gospel presentation and such. Uh, some stories uh, of things that I've seen and others that uh, are part of prayer teams that we will be bringing with to Our Lady of Grace. So there'll be some prayer teams there that are very well trained, um, very good people um, that have done this many times, prayed with people for hours and hours and hours. They'll be coming with, and so there'll be um, those prayer teams available. And so the first part uh, after the, the sermon is uh, what's called essentially a corporate prayer portion of the evening. So you will essentially pray with each other. I will help you um, and you'll pray with each other. We'll pray for each other in sort of a corporate setting, see what the Lord does there. And then after that, you'll have the opportunity to actually go to individual prayer teams. Um, and in the individual prayer teams, you can be a lot more specific about what it is that you want prayer for. And again, as I said, these people that uh, that are going to be there, I'll be praying, certainly others will be praying. Um, the, the prayer teams are very well trained, very, very good people. Uh, and so just really hope that that you're able to come and see the amazing things that God um, is truly going to do. Uh, at the last healing service, just at the cathedral, um, you know, many people experienced some form of physical healing. Uh, we had an older man who was not really able to speak because of his jaw. Uh, there were some issues with his jaw and his tongue as we prayed. Um, he felt, you know, the presence, the heat of God. And he was able to talk, um, able to talk normally, able to talk without difficulty. Uh, many people who, you know, just with shoulder injuries, back injuries, some of the, so to speak, basic stuff, right? The, the Lord's generous and, and takes the pain away. Um, and on and on and on. Uh, we'll obviously be praying for cancers and anything um, that we would, you know, consider quite a bit more serious than some of your, your more day-to-day -day stuff. So anyway, just invite you to come to that healing service. Really hope uh, to see you there. I know it's going to be great. It's a beautiful opportunity. Uh, to experience God in a way that perhaps you never have before. Uh, God bless you. See you next week.